Mm, mm, mm. Trials and tribulations, y'all. It's your girl, Just Jen. Driving over to Mr. Country's place that he's renting because he can't seem to get his S-H-I-T together. I've been there the last couple days in a row. I was there 11 o'clock the night before to go pick him up in Brandon, which is a very far drive from me. And I picked him up at 9 o'clock last night. Or, I'm sorry, the night before. And, uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm adjusting the nose ring because it's this plastic thing that I really don't like. Anyway, um, got a dog crate in the back. That's what's that metal shaky noise. Sorry. Got lots of sand cranes out here in the middle of the road. Let's see if I can film them in a second, but um, yeah, I am out here because it is 8.07 in the freaking morning. That's what my car says. That's not the real time. It's by 9.07. Anyway, if you guys can see the... Where are you? Why are you not on camera? There's one. There's three of them here. They're like Houdini birds, they can hide. Alright, there's another one. And somewhere there, there's another one. Anyway. Um, uh, yeah, I'm not real amused at this moment because I'm having to come over here to take a grown ass man to task on behaving like a grown ass man. It makes no sense to me. The homeowner actually that he's renting from asked me to make sure that he stays on track and stops doing the stupid crap he's been doing, which is drinking to excess. His children have asked me to come over and make sure he's not drinking to excess. And I'm in front of the house now, but I don't see, I see his bike. I don't see the car for the homeowner. So. Anyway, that's where I'm at. Basically babysitting a grown-ass man. <laughs> Which I shouldn't have to do. Shut up, car. Shut up. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm not real amused right now with him at all. And I already told him the other day when I went to pick him up, I'm done. I'm done. I got nothing to do with you. I'm done. If it wasn't for his daughter and his son asking me to come help, and the homeowner asking me to come help, I wouldn't even be here. And this person next to me appears to not know how to back out of a driveway if there's a car nearby. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'll add to this vlog later. Bye. Mm -mm -mm, my people, my people, I am pissed off to the highest level of pissivity right now. I am absolutely over trying to help somebody that does not appreciate the help. Want to accept the help and then turns around and tries to badmouth you when you did nothing wrong. Especially when you got them where they are, which is a lot further than where they were. Ugh! I am so pissed right now, I can't even explain to y'all. Just the fact that somebody would give you an attitude and talk badly about you to somebody else when you've done six billion things for them, what kind of F S is that? I'm trying to keep it clean for the moment. Anyway, just had to have a long talk with the uh, homeowner that a certain person is renting a room from, and that person wants to give me an attitude. When they're breaking every rule the person freaking gave them. But that's my fault. That makes me bad. And then you want to talk junk to your friend. Who I didn't even know you moved your friend in there. And have your friend start talking junk about me. To where the homeowner had to tell your friend. Step off because that ain't your business. Yeah. That's where I'm at today. Sorry it's a very... Mmm, whatever vlog. It's a very non-specific vlog. But I am out here using the last 
breaths of gas that I have in my car to look for this person because their children have asked me about it and to try to help find this person. I'm tired of babysitting. I got one more go round the block and I'm going to go take my car home before I run out of gas because I'm tired. I'm fed up. I've had enough. And it's been three days in a row that I have been out looking for this individual and they have zero appreciation whatsoever for it. Anyway, y'all know what I'm going to say. Hit the like, subscribe, notification bell so that you know when the next episode of Jen trying to search for people that don't give a shit. Sorry, there's a curse word for you. Comes up. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.